Day two of vlogging every day in December. Sether. Yeah. It snowed last night. Yeah, it's awesome. It's already pretty much off of the roof up there. Coming off of that roof there. Coming off of there. Oh uh, yeah. How much did we get? Hmm. Maybe three quarters of an inch or so on a warm hood. That's not bad, man. That's not bad. Every little bit counts. Wow. The danger zone right there, man. You've got to uh, keep your collar tight just in case it falls on you. You don't want it going down your shirt. That's my theory anyway. If you're new here, we're building an off-grid homestead from scratch in North Idaho, debt-free. And right now, we are on the insulation phase, but we're nearly done with it, man. We've got all of the wall insulation done. Whoosh. And we also got the ceiling done yesterday. Hey, you're upside down. We got a little bit more ceiling insulation. We've got this right up here in the bathroom we need to get done. Also, over here in the laundry room. But that's it. That's it for the insulation. Finally, that's going to be done. Oh, don't look in here though, okay guys? This is not done yet. Those are two bedrooms that uh, we can't actually finish yet because we're waiting for the guy to come and start up the furnace for us. And just in case there's a problem, we don't wanna to have to have all that sheetrock up there and everything to, to try to get that furnace out if there's something wrong with it from the manufacturer. Alrighty, Southers, getting the insulation up here in the closet. That's super tight fit in here though. Yeah. that look yeah looks like it might be okay might have to go up and look at it from the other room from the bedroom there and look over at the top of it and see if there's any gaps or anything come up here in the bedroom and see if we can see any gaps or anything in that insulation Let's see here oh yeah that's looking good man no big gaps or nothing up here this might hey Sather. Actually, right up here. So, this side here, yeah. if you could push that up and then pull it back down, it'll Wait, fluff it up. Right here? Yeah, so, no, this, yeah, that one. Yeah, down there further. Yep, I mean, you gotta push them up and then up a little bit more. Uh -huh. Up a little bit more, it's still caught down there. A little bit more in the middle. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Yeah. Fluffy. All I get is this one little light you see. What I want is the freedom to just be me. There's no place in this world I would There's another corner right here that we need to fix for the sheetrock. Uh, hopefully this is the last one. I think it is, but I'm not 100% sure. Let's go see what these boys have been getting done this morning, you guys. I'm so excited. I hear Jill's coming. Hello. Hey, hey, pa. Wow. Yeah, it's coming out good, huh? We, we're dual vlogging. Dual vlogging. <laughs> yeah. What do you Look think? At this. Wow. You saw this done yesterday, yeah? Yeah, this part was done. Okay, yeah. check out the bathroom. Okay. Ooh. Wow. You even got it all cut away from the for the fan and everything. It's so much like quieter in here. <laughs> I know it, huh? <laughs> it looks like it's not all echoey. Like it's starting to sound like a, a real place you'd want to live in. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, cool, guys. Check out the laundry room. Okay. Those lights are like so bright, blind. I know it, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah, nice. Okay, I see how you did that. Nice. <laughs> so, let's go see what other kind of mischief we could get into today.
Come on. Come on. Jules found us a cool spot here we're gonna stop at. Huh, what'd yeah. you find us? I know, I've been hoping to find a sledding hill near our house and I think we've got one. It's a small one, but it'll be worth it. <laughs> you guys saw them sledding earlier, but this one's steep, man. We're gonna start the journey, oh mama. Start the journey up the hill. Part of the trouble is just getting up. Oh dear, this looks rather difficult. Well. <laughs> Okay. Oh no, ducks! Wait, I gotta finish it. That was awesome. All right, so it's my turn now. They got me the uh, sled here. I don't know that these things are made for 200. Whoa, oh, hey, we're going! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> Wipe out. <laughs> uh, Do you know what time it is? What time? No. Yes. Here? What? Oh, no. What? Push ups. No. Push ups. We can do this as an okay. extra challenge. Two Come push -ups. on. We can do Let's it. Do it. All right. The two today is day number two, so it's two push ups today. Let's do All right, it, guys. You guys too. So, if you can do it, get down on the floor, lean against the wall, the counter, whatever you got. Your knees. Your knees. On, yeah. Two push ups today, guys. You ready? Yep. Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, that's. Ready? Yeah. Go. One, <laughs> two. Okay. <laughs> Oh. We didn't have to go down nearly as far this time, though. These are a little easier. It was a little bit of motivation to get up. That's right. Huh? Hey, Bucky. Staying dry. We've got any eggs. I highly doubt it, though. Nothing. If they're on an egg break. <laughs> All right, let's go check on the babies. They hatched like a couple days, I think, or like a week after I left for um, fall semester this year. So I actually haven't really gotten to meet them yet. <laughs> a lot of people ask if you're off grid, like how do you keep your chicken water from freezing? Well, I did an experiment with this. <laughs> this is actually the lid for our septic tank. And obviously, it's much warmer in this area. Mom. <laughs> but look, the water has like a tiny layer of ice on it. And so, so far, this has been out in, I don't know, maybe like four or five days. And <laughs> it's working. Hello. Hello, babies. They don't want to come out. Hey, buddies. Hello, babies. Hello, babies. <laughs> They're like, we're not coming out. Oh, yeah, get away, yeah. Hey, Jennifer Frud or Jennifer Frude. Sorry, I'm not sure which way you pronounce your name, but you've got a great question about Thrive Life. And are we distributors of Thrive Life? And where can you find the link to it? If you are unfamiliar with Thrive Life, this is all freeze-dried food. It has a 25-year shelf life, and they're all individual mostly raw ingredients. The only things that are cooked that I'm aware of are the meat, like this right here. You've got ground sausage, you've got pulled pork, you've got shrimp up here. Spiders are not included. The eggs down here, those are raw. We've got ground beef and chicken slices. But all of this stuff over here, the fruit and the vegetables, those are all raw. So, to answer your question, Jennifer, yes, we are consultants for Thrive Life. I guess you could kind of call that a distributor. And there is a link down in the description of this video where you could actually find all of the Thrive Life stuff. You could order it. And of course, we will get a small commission if you do order something. 
But thank you for asking, Jennifer. If any of you other guys have a question that you really want to ask us, go ahead, put it down in the comments below because all the month of December, we're doing a video a day for you guys in December. We're going to answer one of your questions. Jennifer, thanks so much for the question. Thanks for hanging out with us today. We had a lot of fun in the snow. We picked out this video right here for you if you'd like to go ahead and watch that. Otherwise, we hope you guys have a really great day. Keep, Keep smiling! smiling.